Ooh, hi, squad. You won't believe what RJ just did. Mm -hmm. RJ! OMG! Oh boy, squad. Check out what RJ has been working on. RJ made lunch. Mmm, broccoli, love. And look at this crab. Like, I've never seen a crab like this. Where did we get this? The palenque? SNR. Oh, wow. Look at that, guys. Have you guys seen a crab like this before? It's so alien looking. Man, crustacea. I can't wait to try it. There you go. OMG, there's more. <gasps> Look at those clams. Mmm, perfect. Beautiful seafood lunch. Aw, bet thank you. Let's eat. OMG, guys. <laughs> Boiled to the max. I don't know how it tastes like. <laughs> I'm sure it tastes delicious. I don't know how to eat this crab. Oh my god, guys, look at this massive. This looks like it's out of a video game. Seriously, it looks like a Pokemon. Hey. Ah. It looks like a turtle to me. <laughs> yeah, it's very turtle-like. It's very alien-like. It looks like a mite. You know what I mean? Like a giant mite. Mm, and it, guys, it smells like really sweet, delectable lobster. Oh, mmm. Can't wait to try that. All right, let's get some clams over here. Love it. Okay, so how did you cook this stuff, RJ? What did you use? What are your ingredients? Oh, it's just garlic and butter, and I put some red pepper, mm. bell pepper, I mean. Mm. But before that, before I cook it with butter and garlic, I had to steam this with uh, Sprite. <laughs> steam the crab with Sprite? Yeah. No wonder it smells sweet. Okay, guys, let's first try the clams. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, mmm! The clams taste so clean. Well, they're darn good clams. Yeah, I used to lose it in the Chinese restaurant. Oh my gosh, mmm, 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 mmm. I can't wait for you to have your own kitchen. Yeah. And I'm a boy, it's got home. Mmm, all right. Broccoli, so full of good stuff, including protein. Mmm, oh yeah. Now, seriously, gotta open this. I need to bring you closer for this one. This is gonna be, this is gonna be a project. All right, so I'm assuming, look at how small the abdomen flap is. Seriously, look at that. Oh my, okay. Do I open it the same way we open Filipino crab? Oh, okay. That just completely came off. Do we need one of those nutcracker things? Oh my gosh, this is hard to get into. Uh, okay, there's a leg. How do we, oh my goodness. Let me use this giant fork. Wow, this is like this is like a puzzle. It's like an escape room. Okay. I'm getting in. Oh my oh there there is so much meat in there. It's opening. It's slowly opening. Come on, crap. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. It's meaty enough. Holy guys, look at this meat. Look at all that meat. Okay, we'll get to that later. I'm gonna get into this head here which looks like it's packed with like delicious alligay. Mmm. OMG, so good. Oh my gosh, so good. That is even better than a lobster head. Seriously guys, seriously. Mmm, very good man. Guys, look at this meat. Mmm, oh my gosh, mmm. Okay, the meat on that doesn't taste like regular crab, first of all. It's a bit like, mmm. What does that taste like? It's a bit saltier. Tastes a bit like sea urchin, in case you guys have ever had uni. Sorry, I'm still here. Okay, let's try all of this stuff here. Look at that, all of that good stuff. Mmm, crab fat. Mmm, OMG, oh my gosh, wow. Oh my gosh, look at RJ's. There you go. Mmm, the meat, mmm. I want this alligator, see all this yellow crab fat stuff? I gotta excavate it. It's okay, I washed my hands. Mmm, yes. You can have this. Thanks, man. RJ always gives me his crab head and like shrimp head and all that. Mm. Sorry guys, there's no neat way to eat crab. Oh my gosh, wow RJ, your head has so many eggs. Mm. Yes, seafood for the win, you know what I'm saying? RJ is a fantastic cook, by the way. Oh, by the way guys, my name is Mikey Bustos. Welcome to the channel. Be sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed this vlog. It's free. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and join the Mabu High Squad. We'll be your daily dose of positive vibes online. And hey, we eat a lot on this channel too, so don't be alarmed. It's all part of regular, regular life here on the channel. 
Mm, 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 mm. Wow. Oh yeah, and I'm Mikey Bustos, originally from Toronto, Canada. We live here in the Philippines. This is RJ Hi there. from the Philippines, who is my partner and manager in life. My, basically my life partner. Hey guys, check out the aftermath. Mm-hmm. We serious. guys so RJ and I have packed because we are uh, going to be heading out of town not too far from Manila but maybe an hour or two away uh, in Batangas because this is where the great Spartan race is happening the big race that I Raquel my cousin and Mark, my cousin too um, we've all been training for this is like a 21 kilometer marathon with obstacles so like we're gonna die um, but this is taking place out of town so We've uh, booked a hotel for tonight, um, and we're really excited about this. The guys have to tell you how long we'll be gone. Come, come here. The Gaia, she's quiet now. Time for bye bye. One, time for sleep, sleep, sleep. Two, time for sleep, sleep, sleep. Yay, I'm back. Okay, not too long, just two nights. That's how we do it. All right, guys, here with the gang. There's Raquel, Nika, yes, and Mark. And RJ, guys, we're pigging out like tons of Chinese food. I believe this is Taiwanese food. See? I know. We're gonna we're gonna bathe in this bowl. Look how big this bowl is. So we're eating lots right now because, of course, the race is tomorrow. We need to carb a load, guys. We need lots of carbs. But by force of habit, the urge to order lots of vegetables. I'm hungry. Come on, veggies. But I gotta start eating carbs. <laughs> or I'm gonna dodge them all. Guys, look at this. It's like spicy beef. It looks so spicy. Mm. Oh, fried rice. Talking about carbs. Oh, and noodles. I'm gonna tackle this one carb at a time. I'm gonna try this beef first. Spicy. It's good. <laughs> no, it just went down the wrong hole. That beef's good. Guys, it's just easy to breathe in the chili oil. It's spicy. Right, try it again. So good. Now, this is the most rice I've had in a long time. Guys, rice. Mm. Oh my gosh, I forgot how good rice is. So guys, I've been on sort of like a low carb, low sugar, high fat diet. They call it keto, but I cheat it all the time. But I'm, I've never eaten rice like like this for years. Mm. Mm. Oh my gosh, this rice is so good. Very good. Oh my gosh, there's so much food coming. Mm. Hey guys, broccoli, I ordered this. Yeah. Guys, vegetables are so satisfying. Pork ribs. Mm. Mm. So good. Crunchy fried pork. Steam buns. Mm. Okay, how's the food? Super good. <laughs> How's the food, Todd? Not it. <laughs> you eating all that carbs? Yes, all the carbs, carbs? 21 <laughs> kilometers. Okay, so I asked my dad to tell, help me visualize how long 21 kilometers is. I thought it was just like from my house to the mall. No, it's like my house to downtown. Guys, that's gonna be far. Guys, more carb loading. Noodles. Mmm. one I know that spicy beef. Mm. 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 I love carbs. Guys, the 
dessert arrived looked dates. Mm. Have you guys seen our vlogs in Qatar and Dubai? <gasps> Love dates. Mm. And what's inside? Rice? Yeah. Rice cake. Perfect. Guys, yeah. let's carbo load this. Oh, it's hot. Uh huh. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh, wow. Mm. Oh now guys, ever since switching over to keto, like maybe four years ago, I've been on keto for four years. When I do eat carbs, it feels heavy in my stomach, like I feel so bloated. And then in a couple hours, I'll be so hungry, like hunger pangs come when I eat carbs again. And I heard it's because the blood sugar in your blood rises and then all of a sudden when it's all used up, it falls and that's when you get your hunger pangs. When you're on keto, you don't really feel hungry. And Especially now that I've been eating a lot more vegetables than anything else. All of this, the noodles and the rice, it feels different down here somehow. It's like a bloating. I don't know. Hard to explain. But so good. Oh my, it's foggy. Okay, we're checking into the hotel now. Interesting location in the middle of nowhere. Everything's so foggy. All right, guys. Oh my, there's like pine tree right in my face. Right when I open this door. We're here at the hotel. RJ, are you gonna get the bags? Yeah. I'll get my bag. We packed for like two nights. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so fun. Ooh, I love the weather here, guys. We're in Tagaytay, so it's up in the mountain. So it feels so good, this weather. It's nice and cool, unlike Manila, where we would be sweating right now. I hear music in the distance. Wedding party, let's go crash it. Wow, guys, look at this place. Oh, it's not here? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sorry. I was gonna say it's a beautiful place. Okay, guys, that's not it, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Wow, OMG, look at this pool. Massive. Oh my gosh, that is awesome. What a great, what a great place. This place is called Farm Hills, guys. In <gasps> All right, it's our hotel room. This is a huge, huge hotel. And apparently it's new. Like this is their soft opening. All right, let's see. See the room? Oh my gosh, wow, wow. Look at this room, OMG. <gasps> Beautiful. OMG, wow, look at the plant, it's real. OMG, that's a baby bird's nest fern. Uh, amazing, big screen TV. Oh, my work desk, but I'm not doing work this trip. Wow, look at the beds. Okay, awesome, awesome. Love the cove lighting behind the headboard. Beautiful fabric. I love headboards. I love the painting. OMG, the ceiling, guys. OMG, look at that clock. That's so antique looking. We got closet space. OMG, a hairy Asian. Hey. Oh my god, wow, look at the bathroom. That's very unique. Oh, RJ, it's the, this kind. The one you like. The sink that comes out, made of like aluminum. Oh, but look at their finish. It's so classy looking. Look at all this stuff, which we're gonna take home because we're Filipino. <laughs> Hairy Asian. Hey. I love the shower. Oh, with the round shower, like rain shower head. This is so neat. OMG, more live plants, love it. And bathroom, how awesome. I really love the fine details of this place. Look at this tissue dispenser. I love that. Even the, even the walls, so nice. This is a very, very nice hotel. And this like mirror is hanging from this like strap here, like a bag, you see that? The details. OMG guys, I love this chair. Look at the patchwork, awesome. So cute. Please be alcohol, please be alcohol, please be. Oh, I guess it's for the better because tomorrow we're running a 21 kilometer marathon with obstacles. I just love the use of live plants everywhere. Uh, so cute. All right guys, so I've showered, gonna get ready for bed. One thing I wanted to show you though is this. Look, I used to have, like this morning, I had a six pack and now it's disappearing. See that? Just a few hours of eating all those carbs <laughs> and I'm gonna continue to blow up and bloat up over the next few hours, but I know over time, my body will burn all of that fat, especially tomorrow. When I die at Spartan, OMG guys, can't wait to take you guys with us. This is gonna be crazy. I've never done any marathon in my life, let alone a marathon with like obstacles. And I think I regret eating that spicy food. <laughs> I hope I'm able to get rid of that before the race. See you guys tomorrow. Good morning, Abu High Squad. It's like 4 a.m. in the morning. 
I can't believe we're about to run the biggest race of our life.